Hi guys, Lord Pook, God of Pancakes here, and uh, welcome to another episode of Zero Pro Round 1. I thought it would be a good idea for this series um, if I actually like break down what I do in a game generally. Um, I did a video a couple, I think I did a video recently um, where I actually, where I actually kind of just did it as I was playing along. But I kind of want to go into a little bit more detail about what my thought process was in the actual games. So without having to kind of do it on the fly, like um, like I did in the la that last time. Mostly because um, I don't catch the stuff on, don't catch it at the time. And I can actually kind of see what it would be, what would, what I actually could have done, could have done differently and whatnot. Or and and that so like at the time during the games I usually don't I don't have time to really look into it really explore what I actually did anyway so what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to look at a replay of a game that I that I had done um, that I had done recently um, this is actually a function that you have in Fortnite where you can actually see replays. If you're playing on the PC, um, it, it saves a lot more, but um, so yeah. Um, so I'm actually gonna be um, going through my first win of this current season, which was um, which was actually on release night of the Fortnite OG. It was actually like the first win on that map as well, um, because I'm at the time I was still learning the new map, um, which I, still still kind of am a little bit but like i haven't got much experience and we don't have much time with it before the new season so i'm actually gonna i got it saved here um you actually might recognize this clip if you watch uh, one of my more recent videos um i had the the dub was actually the um a short that i did a, last week um or this week actually yeah, well, um, when um, the day, the morning after the game came out, uh, the the latest update. I don't remember exactly when it was, but it was um, it was the one where the guy got destroyed. Um, anyway, um, and what we'll do is we'll kind of have a look into it. Um, I want to especially look into that because that um, that was only like the last fight, thirty seconds of that actual fight. Um, that fight actually went on for quite a while. <laughs> If I remember correctly, it went on for about 10 minutes. Um, it actually kind of got to the point where, because we were just taking pot shots at each other for a couple of minutes, right up until right up until that um, the circle move started moving away, where I actually had to change position. Um, anyway, I'll get into more detail about that once we get into the game. I'm just going to load it up now. Uh, just got to um, change this real quick. So, once I'm in the game, we'll, um, we'll start the breakdown. Is it this one? No, this is the other one. Okay. Alright. Um, as you can see, I've got my, um, I am playing this on mouse. Why is the music changed? That's weird. Um, okay. So... Uh, yeah, so this is just a pre-game lobby. I'm just going to put it in third person. So um, this is just the, the replay function, as I said. Um, you can actually kind of change it so it's fully hidden and all that. Um, another thing that you'll find different is it actually shows all players on the map. Um, so at the moment, we're in the pre-game lobby, so it's not showing. But um, it's also a little glitchy. So um, if it looks like I'm doing stuff weird stuff in the thing that's actually because that's just what the coin looks like um so yeah we'll get into the game now so um I can't remember where I actually landed because like I said this was like one of the first games that is not me um hold on pause I just gotta find me um it actually shows all players as well um, so I'm looking for me, Just give me one second. 
Um, okay. I know I didn't land early. I think I landed... What did I... Did I land Wailing Woods? I might have landed Wailing. Uh, is there a way to search? Oh, yeah. This, this will do. More poop. Okay. Okay, yeah. Sorry, I haven't um, dropped out yet. Okay, now yeah, I'm dropping out. Um, it looks like I'm... Did I go Frenzy? Or... No, not Frenzy. Um, okay, so... What I'm trying to make sure I get a good land. So, as I am coming in... I'm just going to change the HUD real quick. Okay, yeah, so it is... It does look like I'm actually landing in here. And as you can see here, you can see all the other players um, that are coming in the land. So, I was landing here at Fatal Fields. This is, I think this is actually the first time I actually landed at this spot. So I actually don't know where anything is. So as you can see, as I'm looking in, I'm kind of looking for loot while at the same time trying to find um, shields. <laughs> um, the first couple of days, the shields situation was really bad. Um, so first thing I did, uh, shield up and I'm looking for loot. Um, okay. And I think I've got the sniper. I think it's the scope one. Uh, I'm just checking... I'm just um, rearranging my inventory there. Um, you don't really see it. So, okay. I think I actually got a couple early kills here. Um, let me just change HUD. Yeah, as you can see, I'm... Okay. Yeah, so that guy's just, just try, trying to get away. Um, and, yeah. So... I'm pretty sure this might have been a... No, this is an actual player, I think. No, that was a bot. Okay, so you'll find that... Um, let's have a look. Um, if I... Sorry, I'm just going to go back five seconds. And we'll have a look at what happened there. Okay, so I'm just going to switch to this dude, and I'm going to look at what he's doing. Uh, okay. Uh, I'm just going to go back five seconds, just to kind of, just a little bit. Can touch me 67, okay. Yeah, so it's a little bit glitchy, um, as you can see. Okay, yeah, so this is actually an AI. I'm pretty sure that these... Um, yeah, so this is actually an AI player. So... Um, you'll find these a lot, especially like in uh, public lobbies, where players, um, where they have AI controls, and there's me trying to shoot it as well. Wow, he... Yeah, really struggled with that one, and... Actually, might have been a real player, actually. Yeah, he's, um... Yeah, okay, so... Okay. Anyway, so, that, that tends to happen. So, what I'm gonna... What I do there is I, I obviously steal his loot. And... I see another player right there. And... Uh, yeah, that's an actual player there. So, yeah, he's just trying to, trying to um, do that. Um, so, with those players, when that happens... Let me just go back. A little bit. And... Kind of... Uh, this one? Nope. Um... Who is this person? Is there a way to tell? Sorry, I'm still getting used to it. I don't use this um function. It might have been Yeah, okay, so this person obviously hasn't seen me. 
at least I don't think he has. Let's just go back about, uh, let's say 10 seconds. And we'll see what he did. Because it looked like he got a squad. So when you when you land in a hot squad, it, it, the best thing you can do is just um, try to get a gun and get the cover. Yeah, this is actually a real player, yeah. Um, so, okay, as he's coming in, as he's coming in, he, he hasn't actually spotted me, um, so he's just going to cover, and that's going to come in. Uh, yeah. This might be a... This might... Oh, my... Ooh, that was a... Yeah, he got destroyed there. That might have been another bot. It was actually, like, pretty really late that night. So, um, anyway, um, we'll just keep going. So... Um, I'm kind of rotating our circle, but I'm mostly just trying to find loot. I know that we have, um, we have a little bit of time before the, the, the first circle closes. And it looks like we're... Looks like we're, um, we're pretty good. So... I'm just trying to find full shields. Um, as I said, during the first couple of days of this um, uh, this uh, this season, the game it was very difficult to find shields. So a lot of these games you don't find shields. I'm, I'm finding a fair few here, but um, I remember that there were several games that first 24 hours, 48 hours, where you couldn't even find shields. Um, I, I actually ran entire games where I, I didn't find shields at all and then got eliminated first quest I read it to. So yeah, I'm just trying to find more loot. Trying to find the best possible loadout for um for endgame at this point. Um Yep, uh, I end up grabbing do I grab that? Yeah, I end up grabbing um that blue assault rifle, which is really good. And there's another player there. You obviously saw me coming in. Um, okay, so I'm just going to go back and kind of see what he did there. Um, because it looked like he, he knew it was there. So I'm just going to... Nope, that was not him. No more reward, that's funny. Nope. I don't know who... It might have been this dude. Nope. Yeah, oh yeah, here it is. So, I'm not sure. Okay, so he's obviously heard me. And he thought he tried to ambush me, but I, I saw him. Yeah, so he obviously tried to go into an ambush, but um, that happens. Um, it's not much he could have potentially done in that situation. Um, if anything, he could have gone to cover, but it happens. Um, it's possible that that was possibly a bot as well. So you got to have to kind of assume. Um, and with the game, it does with the replays, it doesn't show very well. Um, but it was a lot of, um, there was a very hot landing. So if I remember correctly, I start uh, pushing into the circle at this point. So we'll go in there. It looks like I'm going to get another kill in a second as well. Um, so we'll see what happened. And yeah, it looks like um, there was another firefight. And at this point, I'm like, once I move out of the circle, uh, out of um, the, f the landing zone, I, I try to hunt down as many people as I possibly can. So yeah, so I see a quick kill here. So I, um, I go for it. Uh, and I'm just trying to get used to this weapon. I think it was the first time I ever used it. And yep, that's the fourth one. And yeah. So yeah, so I had I third party there, so it, which um which is probably one of the best moves you can possibly play early game, um or at any point during the game. So you want to try to avoid um avoid getting into fights for too long, um like that. Um, it's possible that I could win a bottom bite there, but it's possible. Um, I only got there right at the end of that fight, so um. I, I don't know, but uh, yeah, there's not much in any situation. There's not much the they could have done. Um, if anything, that first, that second guy should have um, should have uh, took the time to actually rotate away um, and get away. But 
that's not how people play usually. Um, I know I, uh, I have a tendency to do that as well. So, um, okay. So, what is it? Okay, yeah, so it looks like I get another kill very shortly. I still haven't found any more shields. So, as I'm going along, I'm actually trying to find more shields. Is there any players nearby? Yeah, okay. So, um, yeah, so I'll probably check up here. Possibly. No, oh, no, I see gunfire, so I'm going to try to try to see if I can score another elimination real quick. Um, you want to try to end these games quickly. Um, so right now I'm just trying to see if I can spot the guy and I try using to get impulse grenade. Um, funnily enough, that was the moment I realized that they actually don't work like shockwave grenades. Um, and you can get hurt from, uh, falling from height. So I hear gunfire here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get the position. Oh, wait. Oh, so there was a, there was an elimination. Whoops. I actually, I don't really... Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Um, how do I? Okay, I'm gonna go back. Go back 10 seconds. So I can actually see what I did there because that was a really, really smart play I did there. That was a really good um, elimination that I pulled off there. So I'm just gonna go back a little bit more. So. Okay, so as I am where I'm gonna find that other dude. I'll find the name um first. Um how do I close that? Okay. I, I actually think that I think that actually I'm pretty sure that's the dude that I just killed. So um Okay, so as I'm rolling up here. Um, I, I, I'm hearing gunshots and I'm assuming that it's going to be beyond the house. So what I, what I did was climb up the building to try to see if I can get a vantage point for a sniper. Um, but um, as you can see here, they're, they're, um, they're actually here and this guy's actually got fairly okay cover. So... Looks like he's, I'm not sure what, what's he got? Oh, he's got a grenade launcher. So he's going, yeah, he's going pretty hard there. So he, they don't have no idea that I am coming up. I'm, I'm, I'm coming up there to try to third party. So, okay. So I'm actually going to see from his point of view. Oh, wait, is it? Okay, yeah, so... Ah, oh, shit. I didn't mean to do that. Um, back. Sorry, this one, one second. Uh... Okay, so he's coming in for this fight. Um, watch it quickly. Yeah, this is actually like a. Yeah, this is an actual proper player. So, yeah, it looks like the two proper players. So uh, he hasn't noticed me coming up at all. Oh wait, he's actually hears me. So he's actually trying to see if he can sneak up on me, and he's realized realized his mistake right the last second. Um, so. He knew that I, he heard me coming up, but he didn't know where I was. And I've come in and got a, it looks like a right hand peak. So, um, looks like I pulled off a right hand peak on that kill. So I'm just gonna go back to me. It looked like he was really low on health too. So I'm not sure why I'm looking facing this way, but yeah, so it looks like, so, okay. So he's dealt with the dude. Um, he's heard me climbing up, but 
doesn't know where I am. So I've gone for a right hand peek there on high. And I've talked him out before he had a chance to even react. Um, because what I, as you can see, I actually did, while I did the right hand peek, as soon as I took the shot, I hid um, to give me time for my um, shotgun to reload. Um, to reload. And then uh, to for the, the cooldown. And uh, I've gone the quick elimination. I'm not sure what that noise is. Um, the game was glitching. Um, the, uh, that was just a replay glitch. So yeah, um, and again, just doing more um, looting, trying to find some more shields and uh, some health. Um, and I'll probably try to switch out. Oh, I found some health, which is good. So I'm probably trying to find a second health pack um, so I don't end up wasting that one. I'm also looking for chug jugs because I'm pretty sure at this point I found one and I actually found a rift which is really good. Um, this is obviously the first time I've been in this area, so I don't know um, the, the area yet. Um, that's how I got stuck there. Um, so yeah, so this is what you've got to do for most of the game, is just trying to constantly searching um, to try to find better loot. Um, so I think at this point I'm, I'm hoping that I'm trying to find at least some decent shields because I think I do eventually get full shields, if I remember correctly. So I'm just trying to pinpoint where the rocket's coming, uh, the chest is. Um, still no luck, it looks like. So, yeah. Oh, I found a second chest, though. So. Uh, maybe we got... Okay, so I found a second um, health pack, so this will be when I will heal. So I, I don't like to... When I have multiple heals, I don't like to use them unless I absolutely have to. Um, so if I find a spare one, I'll just immediately do it. And as you can see, the circle's starting to close in now. So I'm actually not sure where I'll, I'll probably rotate. I would normally rotate into Dusty here. So i will probably be making my way to Dusty. I might go tilted. It just depends on, on certain factors. Like if there's like a loot, um, a drop, a supply drop, uh, it would it would it would vary on what I would do, but if it's no supply drop, I would normally head into Dusty Divot, and um, because I know I end up in Tomato Town here um, by the end of the game, so so I'm pretty sure um, yeah. So what my play would be, um, I would obviously try to get some to high ground, or um, we'll check Dusty Divot because I know they'll probably have chests. Um, because it, it is a, a POI, so um, that would probably be my next bet would be to go head straight to Dusty or Tilted. Um, possibly even Loot, loot Lake, depending on where the next circle is going to, where the next circle is going to close. But I'm pretty sure at this point that it's going to be towards this, it's going to be towards this area. So that's where I'm, a, um, I'm shooting for. I usually try to keep track of the circle. Um, if I don't know where the circle is going to end up, I usually try to go for the middle. So I'll usually go whatever the closest POI and then towards the middle of whatever circle I'm in until it gets closer to end game. Then I'll try to work out where I'm, so I can plan my next, um, my next move. So I'm going to close the map now. So, um, I'm just going to check. Okay. So it looks like I'm going to get into another fight in a minute as well. So, um, hopefully you can find, okay, yeah, so I've seen the fight straight away, and I see a chance for third party, so I go for it. And, yeah, because he's so distracted, um, he's thinking, he's, he's too focused on the closest target, which is, which is what I would do in that situation. Um, although it looks like one of them's moving a bot. So I've, I've gotten the, the quick... Now, oh, wait, hold on. I've uh, done the thing again. Uh, hard. Yeah, so I just took him out that dude. So there's not much he could have done in that situation. Um, uh, yeah, okay. Yeah, I keep doing that. Um, it's because the, the buttons are right next to each other. So I see there's another player, so I, I thought I'd try to get this dude. But... I um... 
Okay, yeah, so he ended up grappling away. Um, you, he ended up using mobility and was able to get away. Um, I decided to not pursue at that point. Um, mostly because it was a better, it was a better play um, to try to pursue because I wasn't, because I still haven't got full shields at this point. So I don't want to get into any unnecessary fights or, or try to chase anyone down at least until I got more shields. Also, um, partially because it's getting close to end, it's actually in end game now, um, where the top, we're pretty much at top 20 at this point. So I want to try to avoid getting into too many fights. Um, it's really, um, the problem is once, once it gets to this point, when it gets to 20, it's really difficult. It's really easy to get third party at that point. So you want to try to be the person that does the third party instead of being the victim of it. So I'm going to take this rift and, um, I'm actually, okay, it looks like I'm heading towards Loot Lake, um, or Dusty Divot, it'll be one of the two, so I think, yeah, I decided to go to Loot Lake, um, because that's towards the middle, if I remember correctly, yeah, that's towards the middle, yeah, so I'm heading directly to the middle like I would normally do, um, when I'm not sure where the circle's gonna end up. Like I said, they um they changed them the the circles, um and this was like the fourth game that I played, and at this point, um they had actually changed the circles from last season, so I was just still trying to do that. I was also trying to get as many POIs as possible. I was doing quest side quests as I was um I was doing the um the quest to um, unlock stuff at, at the same time, and um. Okay, so at this point, I didn't know what a bu um, the bush thing does. Um, wait, is that what happens? Do I, do I end up picking it up? Oh, no, I'm still looking at that chest. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's um, under there. It's in here. So, I actually made a mistake here, I think. Yeah, so, I should... Um, because I, I didn't know this at the time. Um, like I said, this was on release night and I never played the original map. So I didn't understand how how some of these items, how those items work. Um, particularly the um, the bush, um, bush ring here. So this is definitely a mistake I, I pulled on my... Well, it's not really a mistake because I didn't know. But... Um, if you see a legendary, you should at least check it out. Um, but I think I've actually used those before, but I didn't actually understand what they did. I thought they were just uh, gave you a little bit of cover. So, um, we'll just, yeah. So, let me just back like another five seconds. Sorry about this. I've also like had a pretty solid game. So as I've come in, um, okay. So, okay, so this thing here is a bush. Um, like a, I can't remember what the cord was top of my head, but at the time I, I obviously didn't know. So I, 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 I didn't pick it up. So this thing gives you a, a free extra hit. So if you are low on shields, this is, you grab the, if you find one of these items, you use it straight away because you're a temporary, um, you're immune to one shot. So the first shot an, um, an enemy player take, takes it out, it, um, it, it'll take the hit for you. So you don't lo get, lose any health. Um, normally, like at this point, I know what that is, but um, I think it was actually after this game, I, I decided, I went for, I started using him. Um, mind you, this was like, it was three o'clock in the morning when I, when I, when I played this game. So, um, because of, <laughs> it was, it was 3 a.m. and it was my last game and I was just, I was dead tired. So, um, I, I either wasn't thinking straight or I, I just didn't know, either I didn't notice it or I, I just ignored it. 
um, not knowing what it does. So, but if if you see one of these, um, you should always check to see what they are, especially if you don't know what the item is. I was pretty aware of what that was because I have seen those before and I have used them before, but I, I didn't know about the invulnerability thing at the time because the, the only time I ever used it was um, in Endgame. It, it was like back in chapter... It was back in season one of chapter four. Um, so I'd only been playing for a couple of months at that point. So I, I didn't know exactly how that worked as I'd never used it. Anyway, so yeah, so moving along. Um, I might just fast forward a little bit to see if anything else happens here. Um, okay, so yeah, I'm going to Lazy Links. Um, this actually ends up being one of my, oh, hello. So, this is what I've been looking for all game. Um, that was actually what I was looking for, for, was a chug jug. Now, I don't like using, again, I don't like using these unless I absolutely have to. But in this situation, um, we're in the top 15 at this point. I didn't have a choice, so I did actually take it. Um, I did use it. Um, if anything, I picked a really bad spot to actually do it. I just went for it. Again, um, sleep deprivation does that to you. Um, play Fortnite to on um, at three AM would would do it to you. But this is um, this is a very risky play that I played here. Um, the best course would have been to actually get to get to here and get to Lazy Links and into that building to hopefully find um, some cover so I can actually do it. Because at this point, the map is still pretty big, so it's like. So it's okay at the moment because like there's, there shouldn't be too many players around. In fact, there's only one player in the area at, at the moment, but that could have been really bad for me. I could have actually gotten eliminated easily if someone hadn't been watching. Um, a, good, a person that's good with snipers could actually easily have taken me out in that position. Um, actually, even from there, um, they, uh, they might have been hard pressed to see me. But they would have, um, they might have been able, yeah, they might have been able to get that shot off from, from height there, um, or even over there, or especially up there, but I, I hadn't seen anybody. Um, I also noticed that, like, I'm not surveying as much as I should be in this one. Um, I just, that was just pure luck that no one was there at the time. Um, you just got to assume that nobody's coming. Nobody, um, that there's always someone right around the corner, especially if you're getting chased. Um, there's actually a video coming out. It should be out before this video comes out. Actually, no, it will be out. It should be out to... I intend to have this out tomorrow late. Um, because I haven't actually edited it. I have to edit it still. And, um, I actually probably won't edit much of this, but, um, yeah. So as you can see, he's, um, yeah. Um, where like, if you're getting pursuit, um, you never know if you're just going to get caught out like this with your pants down and you don't want to, um, you don't want to get shot out w while you're doing, while you're recharging. So yeah. Anyway, we'll just keep going. Um, Okay, at this point I am actually surveying because I know it's actually a dumb move what I'm doing right now. Um, but at this point I'm kind of desperate. So I got my full shields now and I picked up my sniper rifle and I immediately... Um, okay, so I'm pretty sure that the circle hasn't closed. Um, so I'm going... Yeah, so this is, um, again, this is like the first time I've ever explored this area. So I'm trying to figure out where this stuff is. I think I actually take, do I take this vehicle? No, I actually didn't know that was a vehicle at the time because they don't, some of the vehicles don't work. Oh, that's weird. So yeah, this actually ended up being one of my favorite lands. Um, it's actually like one of my main lands. And I actually picked up a, um, I actually put a light, picked up a light machine gun, which is so good. I've actually run most of the wins that I've had so far this season have been from using one of those. So at the moment, I'm looking for loot. Um, again, this is the first time I've ever seen this place. So I don't know anything about it. 
Um, so I'm trying to figure out where everything is. Um, did I? No, yeah, again, I ignored the bush thing. I would have actually taken it at that point too, just for the extra hit, especially in a top 10 situation, or top 11 in this case. So I'm trying to figure out where all the loot is. Um, this is actually the moment I discovered my land. So this is actually where I land every game, or most games, when I land Lazy Links, is right here, because I know there's a chest right here and I can just pop it out and grab it. Um, so, um, what I do here, because it's a top 10 situation at this point, I'm trying to find, I decide that this is a really good location to, um, yeah, I'm also trying to decide whether or not I'm going to take the boogie bomb. Um, do I end up keeping it? Oh, I, I took it, but I definitely didn't have it in endgame. Oh yeah, I found a grappler at this point. So I, I found, I finally found a mobility item. That's the other thing I've been looking for all game. Um, I think that was when I made the decision to, yeah, I decided to get rid of the, yeah, I decided to get rid of the um, grenades and I think, or did I keep them? I think I just kept them at this point. So, because I didn't have any heals, so I figured I'd just take both of them. Okay, so. I'm just trying to find a good snipe, trying to see if I can get a quick snipe out of people. Um, so I'm just going to skip ahead a little bit, see if there's any, um, yeah, so I'm trying to make a decision. I actually ended up switching. I actually ended up taking the bunker, actually, um, which is, which are really good items. But I, I tend to not use them too much. Um, I prefer to just use normal cover. I, I like to um, have people not knowing where I am, especially at this point. So we're at top seven. So at this point, I've just um, it's rotated in. So this is what I normally do when I rotate into a area like this in end game. So again, like I'm still getting used to this mo um, this uh, map and the way the circles work, because they don't work the same as they did. They actually work closer to what they did back in chapter one. I mean, uh, no, not chapter one. Um, actually, probably, probably, yeah. But um, the, the the way it was in um, season one of chapter four, um, where they, they don't actually get into, they don't actually go into the, into the zone. They just um, kind of stay in there, so you just the whole round and swing. But at this point, the map's trying to, to to end the game because it's getting close to like how far in we? Um, uh, let's close that off. Um, so we are in. I'm actually not sure what zone we are. Um, this will be yeah. So at this point. I'm rotating, um, rotating in. So I'm gonna, I'm actually gonna slow it down a little bit to kind of, yeah, okay. So at this point, um, I'm just trying to find find any, any last loop before I actually move on. Um, at this point, I realized that this is actually a vehicle, so I decided to take it. Um, so, Okay, so we're in top five now. Um, so I decide I don't go in. I don't go directly in. I go in. I try to go into the side. So I, I literally rotate into the thing. I don't go straight in um, just to make sure that I have the best chance of actually getting um, not getting um, taken out while I'm walking in. And. There's only five players left, so I think the last dude. Yeah, this is the other dude. Um, that's that dude. Okay, so as you can see, I'm trying to get in. Um, I think. Okay, yeah, yeah. So I'm. So as I'm kind of going in, I'm being really wary about what's going on, and. Um, yeah, I just decided to just go straight to cover at this point. So I'm just running in and um, I'm about to run into another player and I decided the first thing to do is to grapple. I actually, I think the other guy spotted, I think I got spotted actually. Um, let's have a look. 
because I've actually don't remember. I, I remember that I took this dude out. Yeah, so, um, wait, that's Hubcoat Donors? Wait, so that's a dude, okay, so this is a dude that ends up, um, I end up 1v1ing, if I remember correctly. So, I'm coming in, so I'm coming in here, that's me, um, that's, I'm assuming that's this dude, and, okay, I think he's heard me at this point. Um, okay, yeah, he's seen me, but I... I can't see him. Yeah, I, I didn't see him at all um, when I was running in. So he, he does what every player would do in that situation and try to take a shot to try to t knock my shields. In hindsight, that's actually kind of hilarious because I because of what's going to happen. Um, okay, so he's he's he started to try to lay some shots into me. Um, well, he did, yeah, so he's seen me up there, so I think he's trying to get me right away. Um, and I'm trying to see if I... Yeah, I can see him there. Does he get away? He has to have. He, ha he has to have. Uh, oh, I actually took that dude out. I thought that... Oh, okay. Okay, I was wrong. That was actually not the, the guy I thought it was. Um, I actually thought that was the guy that was that I ended up with 1v running at the end of the game. But... Um, yeah, let's actually just play that back a little bit. I want to... Because I remember, I took that, I 100% took that dude out. Um, okay, so I'm trying to get the shot off. I'm using cover. He's decided to sprint away. Um, which is probably the smart, probably not the smartest move. It would have been better to get the cover. He, he was trying to, it looked like he was trying to get to that but um if I we go back a little bit um yeah so if we go back a little bit he's taking a couple shots at me there was I can see at least three options he could have had he could have could have gone right there and you would have had decent cover there um he could have gone left he could have even gone yeah he could have gone left yeah at this point he's screwed uh, there's no he had no chance he especially once he got low um when someone's been taking shots at you know, like that for like when they got when you're getting completely sniped, when you're getting sniped like that, um, there's not much you can do. But at the same time, he could have he put himself in that position. Um, this is chicken, dude. Huh. Okay, so yeah, he's in cover there, and you can see from his angle, he decides to sprint off. Yeah, so he's. Yeah, so at that point, you okay, so from this angle, even if he went right, he might have, uh, he, he might not have gotten there in time. Um, if he went left there, he could have possibly gotten a little bit of thing, would have held off the fight for a couple of seconds at least, um, would have maybe re-aimed, so it would have probably given him half a chance to maybe even get a shield off. Um, depending if he had any, I can't tell. Um, looks like he only had a, um... Uh, sorry about that. That was my, um, my iPad. Um, so, yeah, so that... Yeah, there was not much he could have done after he started running up here. Um, once he got to that... That point where he was, where he actually tried to fight back, um, yeah, he was too badly damaged. It, it was... 
he was already dead. He was already eliminated. So at that point, there was nothing else he could have done. Um, okay, so I've taken him out now. So now at this point, it's a free free on one. So I got fairly decent position here. Um, it's not the best. Uh, it sounds like um, one of the... Okay, so... Okay, so I'm pretty sure that's the dude. Is that the dude? Okay, so I'm pretty sure this is the dude that I end up fighting for, like, the next 10 minutes. Um, yeah, literally the next 10 minutes. So, um... So... This guy got a... He's obviously... This guy actually got really sweaty, too. Um, he was really sweaty. Yeah, this was definitely the um, the, the guy um, that I ended up fighting. So, I'm actually really curious to see what he what his game plan was, especially at this point. Um, because at the time, I was, I was actually in my position for most of the last... Because I pretty much hold that position up until right until right until the game is just about to end um wait one sec uh, excuse me okay so close um sorry i had to um, mute my for a second um so oh my um my thing's doing the thing again uh okay there's nothing i can do about that so at this point, I don't know where the other two players are. So I'm trying to think. I, I know that they're somewhere around there. Uh, I know that there's at least one player left. Um, is there... Okay, and there's one more player here. So where is the last player? So I'm... I'm assuming that the last player is currently rotating in. So I have no idea where he is. Um, where is he? Yeah, he's not even on screen at the moment. He's not, even, not in my um, my range. So I have no idea where he is at, at that moment. But, I know, but I'm sort of aware that this dude's here. And, okay, so he had a chug joke. So he was at full health when I um, encountered him. Okay, that's good to know. Um, because this guy, this guy, um, was a pain in the ass. Um, so I, I know that there's a guy there. Um, there's also like a, a chest here. So in this situation, I would never go for that chest. Um, I don't know if I actually ended up doing it. Sometimes I do, depending on the situation. I'm in a really good spot at the, at the time. So like health wise, and I'm pretty sure, pretty sure I don't even have a shotgun at this point. Um, I think I got rid of my shotgun, so I, which I'm pretty sure is the only reason why I actually rotated out at this point. So, um, so I'm just trying to find the dude and I think it's around now that I actually spot him. Um, okay. Yeah. So I've just spotted him. I can, I can see him there. So I've just spotted him. So I'm trying to get this dude so he hasn't spotted me yet so if we go to him yeah he hasn't spotted me at all okay and okay so the third dude's actually finally rotated in as well so he's actually on my screen now um i'm actually not sure what's going on there so um, yeah, so he's trying to find me. He can't see me at all. Um, I think I'm like around here. I, I think. Um, no, not Ankasar. Okay. Yeah, so I, yeah, I'm looking at him from that angle. Um, so I, I can see him. I got, I can see him completely because there's like a, the head cam is very, um, very high up, especially when you're in cover, so you can actually see a lot of the map. So I, I know exactly where he is, and I'm just trying to figure out. Um, I'm going to try to try to pop off a couple shots on him, 
to make sure. Wait, uh, wait, hold on. Yeah, so I lost him again. Um, okay, yeah, so I just squatted him again. So I'm going to try to take a pot shot and. Okay, yeah, he hasn't actually squatted me. He he isn't aware where I am yet. Um, so if I had a um, a scope, like because I'm using the scope assault rifle at this point, I haven't got a bolt action sniper rifle. Um, it's, this is a pretty weak, um, pretty weak rifle. It it does its job, but um, but it's not as good as the um, the other the the other sniper or even like the hunting rifle um it won't one shot especially a dude at full health like he is so i take my first shot here and i think i yeah oh i yeah it looks like i cracked him so i managed to crack him um you can't really tell very well uh no i'm just gonna you can't really tell um, with the recording, but yeah, so he's recharging at this point. Actually, I can't even tell who's. Okay, so I'm just going to check. Yeah, so he's. He's actually rotating in the other dude. So. So I'm lining up my shot. And then. Yeah, so he's he now knows he's getting shot at. So he knows that I'm around. Um, did I take multiple shots? I actually don't know. So let me go back to him. Go back to me. Um, yeah, sometimes at that range it's kind of hard. Um again really tired at that point um so i i decided to take the shot here i i see an opportunity and i take it um you can't see what i'm aiming at but i'm not no scoping it but yeah and see immediately i go into cover i also reload there um i didn't want to um, it's a habit I'd have. It was just like, if I take a sniper shot, I automatically reload. Um, it's just a habit because a lot of the sniper rifles in this game only have one shot. So, and sometimes they don't reload automatically. So I've hidden myself. So he can't even see me at the moment. So yeah, so he can't even see me. He knows I'm around. Um, so he's, I think he decides to, yeah, so he started moving around. Um, honestly, at this point, he probably would have been better off trying to move, um, move completely. So I'm going to go back to me. So yeah, he's still running around like a headless chicken over there. Um, cause he can't spot me. Um, yeah, so he does actually eventually rotate. He decides to go to cover because he doesn't know where I am. Um, so he's, he's, his only option at that point is to rotate over here. Um, oh, he, I think he actually picks up. Yeah. He, oh, he decides to, um, he sees a grappler. So he decides to go for it. Um, and it looks like the circle just switched over as well. Um, so he's, he has to rotate in. I'm still in circle. Um, it's still getting, yeah, so I don't know where he is now, so I've decided to move myself to this side um, with the circle coming in. But because I know that um, know that a player could potentially be coming out from there, I'm watching out. I'm just checking over there. Um, obviously, I don't know that this dude's over. This dude's already in circle, but that doesn't change your point. That's that's why you always check because. There have been times where I've actually like been eliminated from someone sneaking up behind me. Um, actually, funny story. There's a video I got, a game I got recorded um, the other day. Actually, yesterday, as of this recording, 
where I ran in and um, was actually same scenario. I was I was in a spot like yeah, I just sniped someone, I tried to snipe someone, and I turned around to check and there was literally a guy um, aiming and uh, scoping, um, sniping, about to snipe me. So I actually managed to move out of the way. So that's what. So I, I quickly maneuvered out there, out of the way. Um, so I'm just gonna. I decided to hang hang there because this is actually a really good perch, and I I know that he's around here somewhere. Um, I know he's in that area, and I know he's got a grapple because I would have heard the grapple. Um, so he's rotating in there. I'm still thinking he's over there. Oh wait, yeah, I just see, see him there. So he's trying to figure. He's still trying to figure out where I am. Yeah, so he's still trying to figure out where I am, and he's about to bump into the other player. Yeah, um, the other player, sorry, man, took a shot. So he did the right thing there, going to cover. Actually, the other guy's got height, and at this point, I'm completely fully aware of what's going on. So I'm immediately trying to figure out where they are. I know that they're there, so and I know it's a top two situation. And... Yeah, so this guy's trying to... This guy decides... Uh, okay, yeah, he just decides to go for a 50-50. This is something you should never do. Um, especially, like, if you haven't cracked them. Um, this is just too risky. Um, so, in this situation here, if I was a lot closer, if I was, like, say... If I was, say, here, at this point, I would have charged him. I would have gone in and tried a third party. But, um, because I'm on the other side, on the other side of the circle, um, because I'm on the other side of the circle, there's no chance I'm going to be able to, um, that, and I could also can't see what the, what the hell's going on. So, obviously, there's been a 50-50 situation, and I'm pretty sure that the other guy, because the other guy pushed... Yeah, so he's just going to elim eliminate it. Yeah, so, and um, at this point, this is where where the, the the actual final showdown happens. This actually goes on for quite a while. Um, so he actually nearly died as well. See, that's why you don't, you don't try to, to do 50-50s. This is actually a problem I have. I tend to try to go for these 50-50s. I'm trying to get out of that habit. But this is the main thing you don't want to do is ever try to get a um, try to force a 50-50. So if I'm pretty sure, um, I'm going to go back five seconds to kind of show you because I actually don't know how he got him. Oh, that was a okay. So. I'm just going to push right here. Look up. How look up. Wait, is that... Um, okay. So, on Kassar. See, this is actually... I think this guy... Um, okay, I think this guy is actually an OG. Um, but probably... Okay, yeah. So, so he's got good positioning here. Um, and he's caught this guy completely off guard. So, he just missed his shot. And immediately goes to cover. And you see you, the guy's like still hiding. Um, I think in this situation, I probably would have done the exact same thing. I would have tried to do the thing, but I probably would have been a bit more hesitant doing it. Um, knowing that I missed. So I probably would have just gone for the cover and then tried to um, cra at least crack his shields before I, um, I move in for the kill. And yeah, so he's well, uh, so he's he's immediately gone for it, and yeah, so I'm already aware. So he's gone for the fifty-fifty, um, and it looks like they both actually have the same guns um, because he was out of cover. If he if he had repositioned and actually kind of went to cover, he probably might have actually got it. But because he kind of just went for the straight 50-50, um, 
yeah, that that it's just unfortunate. Um, but that's that, that's how the game's played. Um, so you got to make sure that. So at this point, I'm I know for a fact that one of them's low. Um, so I would try to push at this point, but because I don't know where he is, I can't see him at all. Um, at at the moment, I have no idea where he is. So. I'm just trying to see if I can spot him. I hope, I'm, and I'm hoping that he gets a um, that he goes for it, that he goes for it, um, that he pops his head out so I can try to fish him off before he's doing that. Um, he's probably chug jugging. Yeah, he's chug jugging right now. So I still can't see him at all at this point. So he's probably just trying to grab some loot before the final fight. So I'm still holding my position. Um. I don't like, like I said, um, okay. So I think what he's doing is trying to draw me out. Yeah. So he's trying to go loot. Um, Okay, yeah, so he's trying to grab loot. This guy's obviously a decent player. Um, he probably... Yeah, so he starts shooting to try to draw me out, but I'm I'm not dumb. <laughs> uh, he probably thought it was just a bottle saying, um, it's actually something that I will do um, that I, I've done to try to draw players out, but I don't do that. Um, but I believe he missed shot, but he's done this a couple times, if I remember correctly. Um, in, if I remember correctly, he, um, yeah, so I, don't, I still don't know where he is. Okay. At this point, I've just swatted him. So yeah, he's still trying to find me. It's actually quite funny. So he's thinking I'm over there. He's going to try to rocket me. <laughs> it's actually pretty funny. Actually, now that I think about it and I'm trying to find, get a, a clear shot, which I got one now and I immediately crack him crack his shields so he goes to cover which is definitely a smart move so he knows I'm around here somewhere um, but he doesn't quite know where I am um, actually I think you can actually I'm pretty sure you can actually see me um, wow that's I think I actually hit him again I can't actually tell from this angle um Yeah, so... Okay, yeah. Yeah, so I'm trying to take pot shots at him. He's, he knows now that where I am, so he, he, what he's going to do here is he's going to try to destroy my cover, which is actually probably the only thing he, he's only play at the moment. Um, if anything, he probably could have charged. Um, he probably could have actually gotten a... Um, Oh, so he, he's actually playing smart and like using the rockets and going to cover. Um, this didn't work. Um, this this works um, in some cases, like in a build scenario. That definitely works. Um, yeah, he's just taking shots because he doesn't quite know where I am. Uh, he knows where I am now. So I'm just I'm taking sniper shots because he's he's just trying to destroy my build. And I think this is actually the first shot that. Okay. So at this point, I've just realized that I, um, that the circles rotated to the, um, rotated out. So now I'm no longer in the circle. So I know that I have to rotate, um, pretty quickly. I think I only have like, I had like a minute. So I probably waited. Um, I think at this point I realized that he, okay. Yeah. I, if I remember correctly, um, I realized that this was going to end up being a close, close encounters. So I made, uh, I made the decision earlier in the game. I can't remember when it was where I, I, I swapped my shotguns out and I don't have a shotgun and I'm in a, a POI. So 
I make the decision to try to find a shotgun and then try to reposition myself back up there because I know I'm about to have to have to fight close encounter. So he still thinks I am. I'm pretty sure he still thinks I'm still there. Yeah, he doesn't see me at all. Yeah, so he he doesn't see me at all. So he's just um he's just taking shots. He's hoping that I'm not dumb enough um to not. He was hoping that I'm still there, whereas I've I've actually ran I've I've started I started looking for a shoddy. I can't remember if I jumped back up afterwards. So yeah, that one knocks my thing. So I jump down. I take four damage. Yeah, um, this was actually really dumb. Um, that was actually a really dumb move on my part. Um, again. Um, so I, I wasn't really sure. Um, I, I nearly died to that. So he probably could have won off that if if I if my health was lower. If I played the game a lot more riskier. So first first objective I'm going to do is try to find help. I'm um, trying to rotate into a different spot and then hopefully grab a. Sh oh, I actually heal. I heal straight away because he still thinks I'm. He still thinks I'm in there. So. Yeah, so he takes another shot, and I'm I'm still healing, um, and then I immediately start rotating into the circle. Um, that's what I usually do at this point at, in any situation. If I'm not in a fight, this is kind of like a longer fight, and the guy actually kind of knows where I am. So I've decided to rotate the circle and hopefully find a shoddy. And. I've just noticed that a new and another supply crate. So I know where he's going to be heading. Um, especially since I know where he is. Um, and I, I don't know if he's, if he's hurt or not at all at this point, because I have taken a couple of shots at him. Um, so he's actually still trying to do that. I've rotated in and this, uh, um, where is it? Uh, yeah, so this supply drone's about to land here. Land. So, yeah, so my guess is he would probably, knowing this dude, um, just going to see him play, um, I'm pretty sure he's going to go for it, especially since it's right next to each other. That's what I would do. Um, yeah, so he immediately goes for it, which is probably the smartest move. Um, at this point, have I found a shotgun? Okay, and as that's landing, I'm, I've become aware. I've realized that he's actually got a, um, got the supply drop. So... So as that, as that supply drops dropped in, I knew that he was going to go for it. Um, it was just a judgment call. It's what I would do, especially since I can see him. I saw him run off, so I know that he's going to go for it. So I immediately try to go for the snipe, but he's actually got decent cover. So he, yeah, it's the best one. He, he had cover. So I decide then to try to rotate and try to find that nice shotgun that I really need at the time because I knew this was gonna end up getting really messy so he's he's still looking for me I'm trying to get a shot off I got managed to get one off and yeah so he do, he still doesn't know where I am he's he's completely lost me at this point so I decided to run down here and try to see if I can find a shotgun because I know this is not gonna end quickly so and I and I finally find a shotty. Um, I think he actually takes another shot. At. Um, where was he shooting at? He really likes this rocket launcher. Yeah, because he he's not hundred percent sure where I am. He knows I'm in that area. Oh, he actually saw me. He saw me. Okay, yeah, so he's he's trying to figure out where I am. Um, 
So he decides to just take a shot anyway to try to figure out where I am. Um, try to hopefully try to eliminate me, but I'm safe. I'm unsafe from that rocket. So um, I'm just waiting for this circle to close. Um, so I'm trying to quickly get into the circle. It's not the best location. I actually go back to my that same spot. Yeah, he's still shooting over there, and I've taken another shot. Um, I probably would have ended this a lot sooner if I had the um, a heavy sniper rifle. But at this point, I'm trying to figure out where he just, he just realized he realized he swatted me, so I quickly repositioned um, because that would have actually have hurt me. So I'm I'm doing a quick reload and. I think I was, because I wasn't sure where the circle was. And so we're at really late game now. So this is where, this is where it starts to, um, games usually get chaotic, especially if there's more players. But at this point, um, because the circle is going to move. So we're going to be forced into a fight regardless. So I, I knew that that was about to happen. Um, Actually, no, I didn't know that was going to... I knew it was going to happen eventually. And it felt like it was getting close to that point. So I knew that this was going to happen. And he, he obviously knows as well, because this guy is obviously a decent player. He's a decent player. Um, he's just getting really unlucky with those um, shotgun shots at the moment. Um, as far as I can tell, I haven't even cracked his shields yet. Have I actually cracked his shields yet? No, I haven't even cracked his shields yet. Um, so at this point, um, I know that this is going to be a, a shit show. So I immediately start trying to reposition myself and I'm pretty, um, this is actually, this is actually really, really important here. Um, because I'm trying to rotate in there. He hasn't swatted me yet. He's a. Oh, he's, he just swatted me. So he's taken a couple shots. Um, but because I, I was very quick, because I was quick, I was able to um, get away. Um, I was able to move quickly. Um, so I'm trying to rotate in there. I don't know if there's any cover. So I see that. I see that. That's my only hope. But um, there's a a blind. Uh, there's like open spot there. So I know I'm going to get shot at the second he um he goes for it. Um, I think my plan my plan was to actually go up and try to meet up with him and try to go for the fifty fifty. Um, so he's taking a couple of shots. I'm trying to sprint. Yeah, I made the decision to jump up here, but he still swatted me. So he he's decided. Um, he's, he's he's actually hit me there. Um, so so I um, I try to lay a couple shots on him. I only get a I, I got a really bad shot. I was just playing. I wasn't shooting very well at that point. Um, it's kind of hard when you're just trying to unload. So he switches to a rocket launcher, and I'm. I actually have really bad cover here. Um, I didn't know that <laughs> at the time. Um, yeah, so I try and try to snipe him. So I'm trying to just try to cover shots. As he's do, as he shot the rocket, I knew I realized I was out of cover. So I tried to move away, and he's actually hit me there. So um, he's cracked me. But at the exact same time that he's cracked me, I've cracked him. Um, he's actually slightly wor worse off than I am. Uh, I'm slightly worse off. So he actually decides to go for the, to try to go for style points at this point. So he tries to, so he decides to go in to try to get the quick kill. I, I see that coming. And I switch out of my shotty and take him out. So he tried, he, he obviously thought that he, um, 
I'm pretty sure he thought that he he'd actually gotten me down a lot lower than he actually did. Um, and I think my shields actually um, recharged, started recharging, right? If I remember correctly, my after he I dropped down, my shields started recharging really quickly. Yeah, so my shields already was already partially recharged. Okay, yeah, no, no, they hadn't recharged. So he he knows that I am cracked, and he knows he's cracked. In this situation, I'm not sure. I, I think I, uh, would I have gone? I don't, I wouldn't have I wouldn't have charged in like that. Um, he obviously went for style points here, and he did actually crack me. In. Uh, my shields had started recharging by that by the time he'd gone there, and he started doing. He went in for a slide shot. Which is actually a really good move. Um, but it's only really good if you're using a shoddy. Um, so, but he's trying to do the minigun with the machine gun. And I just absolutely blasted him pretty much at point blank range with a shotgun. Um, there's nothing he could have done at that point. Um, Because he went for a 50-50 here. He decided to go for the 50-50, which probably was the smartest move at the point. Um, so I've gone to cover. So he's he's tried to do that. So he's gone into a slide, gone into that. But but the second he, I came around the corner, because I was ready for him, because I saw him coming, um, I absolutely blasted him with my shotgun, which is what you should do in that situation. There's a hundred percent you should always use a shotgun um when they when you when they get up and close and personal like that. Um and he didn't really have a choice there. Um it was honestly it wasn't the smartest move on his part, but in like if he went shotgun he probably would have um he probably would have gotten me quite easily. Yeah, so my shield's charging. I run for cover. See him launching in. Yeah, so then I go for the shotgun. It wasn't my best shot, but it it did the job. He didn't actually have a shotgun, so yeah, it looks like he didn't even have a shotgun. So that was actually his only play. What did he actually hit me with? I actually don't know what he hit me with. But, yeah, so he, um... Yeah, so... In that situation, he probably... Because he didn't have a shotgun, um... He probably could have waited until, um... Until the circle started moving before he actually went for it. Um... But, yeah, so... Pretty much my thought process at this point... Like, obviously, I won, so, like... Um, and honestly, that was quite embarrassing for him, um, because he was clearly going for the, um, the clip. <laughs> he was probably trying to get the YouTube clip or something like, um, like I was actually, funnily enough. But he, um, yeah, he, that was just bad, bad luck on his part. Um, if he had a shotgun, he probably could have gotten me. Um, but yeah, um, that's pretty much it for the video. Um, I'll actually leave this now. Um, yeah, so, oh, wait, sorry, <laughs> I pushed it on the, on my recording, so, yeah, that's pretty much the best, um, what you can probably do, um, so that was just, like, a breakdown of what you should do in, in those games, um, and kind of my thought processes, what he did at the end, in hindsight, is something I would have pulled off, um, but I, I don't think I would have went into the slide. I probably would have went in to the... Why is the game not loading? Uh, hold on. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, I don't know why I'm getting all those things. Anyway, um, so, yeah. So, if I had a shotgun, that would definitely have been the move. I probably would have went for it anyway. Um, 
I probably would have went for it, especially since I saw that he was cracked. Um, I'm guessing he assumed that I was lower than I actually was, because he did actually get a couple shots off on me um, prior to that. So he decided to try to go for the power move and on the 50 50. And we were at the same health, so it was nothing. Um, that was either going to be me or him at that point. But anyway, um, that, that's it for this video. Um, I, I want to do do a few more. I want definitely want to do more of these and kind of talk about what my thought process is, what was at the time. But yeah, um, with that, uh, if you like this video, please like and sub and uh, join my Discord. Um, I do a lot of Fortnite content, um, clearly. Um, I kind of went on a huge tangent there. Um, but yeah, so with that, um, yeah, like and subscribe and follow my Discord for that more. Um, anyway, um, yeah, uh, so yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Um, and make sure you uh, have fun and play this game, it's great. Um, and I guess I'll see you on the Battle Plus. All right, bye. I, I'm waiting. Um, yeah, uh, yeah. <laughs> okay.